exercise is called single leg reach. I'm going to use my block right here and I want you to lay it down on its side. Start it at the two inch mark. You put your foot right at the corner so it makes an edge right here. So if I put my foot right in front of the other foot on the side of the mat, that's the corner of the mat, which is the line that draws straight across right here. Okay? So I'm at the corner, two inches. I balance on one leg. So if you can't balance on one leg, you gotta start with this. Now, we can do this and hinge at 90 degrees, toe up. I'm gonna lock out my hip. I'm gonna reach through, and I'm gonna push this two inches. I'm gonna come back up to 90 degrees. I'm gonna lock my knee out, I'm gonna hinge again, and I'm gonna push this two inches. Now, when you're doing this, I want you to keep your hips square, up, locked, and then keep that back leg straight when you lift. Okay, that is the key to this exercise. And then at the bottom, you're gonna get that rotation right there, right through the core and through your upper body. So, from right to left, what can you do? If your toe touches down, if I fall over, that's my number, okay, so six. So I go the other side, I put my foot right at that corner like we just talked about. I'm gonna start over at two inches here, and I'm gonna go hinge from my hips, push two inches, stay on balance, hinge, push two inches, stay on balance. Now, this exercise would be a lot easier if I gave you a weight in your hand, kettlebell, something to stabilize you. But what you're learning to do is stabilize your own body so you have better ground force reaction. So for all the sports that you play, especially in golf, balance is key. So by working on your balance, working on that hip hinge, working on that rotation of the T-spine, you're getting multiple things to happen here. If you do 24 reps, that's 12 reps you did if it was 24 inches. So the foot, ankle, knee, hip is all working to keep you in balance, okay? That's strengthening that whole kinetic chain. Very simple exercise you can do at home. You've got your blocks, just use these. It simplifies the movement. And after doing this for a few weeks, you're gonna notice, wow, I can feel the ground. My feet are stronger, my hips are stronger. I have better balance, which is gonna help you with your ball striking and your swing speed. So work on this for a few weeks and I look forward to seeing what your numbers are. See you next time.